Yeah, well, this is Thorand. I was showing this here because I've had some confusion about the chain shirt we used. Thinking, this is 16 gauge, 5 16 inch rings, but it's silver soldered. This over here is the male coif we used. This is butted male, like they're testing on Deadliest Warrior. And as you can see, it gets nice holes in it when you hit it with anything. Anything will thrust through it. This here is what stopped the arrow. This here is what stopped the katana. I mean, on the show they use riveted, but it's actually equivalent to it. So I just wanted you all to see this. Because I've had some confusion on that I'm using crappy mail or something. This is not crappy mail. This is extremely high quality. All silver berets are soldered. Hey, this is Thrad. This is a koi. This is not the chain shirt I tested in the other videos that actually stopped the weapons. This is butted mail. You can hit this with anything and knock holes through it. But we'll test the longsword against it because I had some people honestly think that I was trying to say the longsword was a better weapon and then went to the Roman mail and that's not what we're even getting at. We're getting at butted. It just wasn't used. And guess what? No damage to the mail at all. And I've also heard that the axe would go clean through. Let's check that out. Well, I don't know. You might have a broken sternum or ribs or death anyway, but I don't see one damage there. Can you see that? you see any damage? Hey, this is Thrand, and just in case they try to say something about thrusting, I'm standing here in front of that same chain, and this is silver soldered, equivalent to uh, riveted. And notice it did not punch through. So, what I'm trying to say is they should have tested riveted mail. That's what I've been saying all along. Not um, butted or just bent together.